I'm Dr. Ross Perry and today is the 11th of October 2010 and I'm here with Michael and he's brought a cockatiel by the name of Arnie and there's Arnie. Arnie's a pretty ancient cockatiel, an old boy. Uh, what's his age? About 15 years old. About 15 years of age. Wonderful, wonderful. And I see there's a bit of blood on the bottom of the cage here on the towel. Uh, what, what looks like to be blood, and I can see that he's got very long nails that need to be trimmed. Um, and I can see a number of other changes that um, I find very, very interesting and I'd like to document at some stage. So I'll be doing, stopping the recording and taking some photographs, some still photographs. But the first things that I see here is that we've got a cockatiel that is a very unusual colour. In that he is, aren't you? Hey, you're just brilliant. He's a very, very dark grey, um, and he's a very bright yellow, and he has no powder on his feet, um, and he has no powder on his beak. He's got a shiny beak. He's got a deformed beak, uh, or malformed beak, with a sort of quite a step down in the tip of it, which we'll take photographs of. And he has wispy down feathers that are extending down under his wings from the side of his body. Uh, and they represent the powder bounds. And then from the front on view, um, he is holding his wings in a different position from normal, and he looks as though he's fairly thin. And I put all those things together and I say that he probably, but I don't know so for sure, but he's probably got chronic uh, cytosine beak and feather disease and if he hasn't got that, then he's probably got chronic liver disease. Um, and another thing that I can see at a glance, when I'm just looking at him without handling him, is that many of his flight feathers are narrower. They've grown narrow, um, more narrow than they should be. So his tail, wing feathers are, um, are not as wide as they would be to support normal flight and that he's missing tail feathers. And then on top of all that, Oops! <laughs> <laughs> what do you reckon about that, Arnie? That was a bit of a surprise to you and me, eh? <laughs> there you are, boy. Ah, oh, dear, Arnie. Um, his, his contour feathers on his chest look pretty rough and uneven. So we'll be having... So Arnie's come here with a supposedly um, torn nail, which he has done. He's broken a nail off his uh, left front inside toe. And it's bleeding a little bit, very slowly. So we'll seal that, stop that bleeding, and then we'll get on with the job. But that's an introduction to Arnie of Michael. Uh, have a stop there. Okay, and I'll just make a note of the date, 11 to the 10th, 1, oh. All right, Arnie. Um, birdie with a little bit of a history. All right, watch that nail. Yeah, I know it's caught. No. Hey. Yeah, I know it's caught. That's what the problem is. Uh, that's exactly what the problem is. What has happened is that his nails are growing round in a half circle, and you can mm -hmm. see him struggling to release his foot here. So he yeah. is in urgent need of a nail trim, and um, um, he's not able to unhook himself easily. Are you, Arnie? These nails keep trapping it. And old Arnie. Ouchie, ouchie, ouchie. All right. All right, I want to, want to be bitey, I understand, but I'm not the, the one to be bitten. Hey? You'll probably no. sit on you. If you put your finger under his legs, he'll probably sit on you. Yeah, no, I'll just take hold of him, and then I'll get some photographs. Okay. All righty. We have to take some still photos in a moment. Anyway, there's his broken toe and he's basically just ripped off the thing and it's still bleeding a little bit so we're going to cauterize that and we'll have to have to uh, trim the other toes there's the wispy down feathers that I was telling you about that these feathers here are all abnormal ba basically every feather on his body is abnormal um, so uh, there and particularly these ones here uh, totally abnormal and then he's got um, little deformed tail feathers here and missing tail feathers, a bit of damage there. 
and his breast muscle here is um, not as well rounded, not as convex as it should be. He's got some blood from his toe smeared here. Uh, he's got some beak rot there. And um, what else? Hey, got a little strange tag on the side of his beak here. Um, and his nostrils are okay, his eyes are okay. Crest feathers are wispy. Hey matey, not here to hurt you. And there you can see his very, very abnormal flight feathers. So these ones down here are normal, or more normal. These ones out here have grown very, very narrow and, um, and thin and would not support normal flight. And I expect the same pattern to be on the other wing. Um, he's going through a molt, he's molting unevenly. These feathers are growing, but we can see that they're growing in a deformed manner. So we've got some blood quills, such as this one here, still actively growing. And we've got more blood quills down here, so he's replacing these flight feathers. But again, um, he would not be able to fly properly with this. So things are out of whack big time. Okie dokie. Well, well, let's put you back in there for a moment. And we'll get something to cauterise that little toe and stop that bleeding and we'll be back.